Yo guys, what is up? This is Nick. We are back, and we hit 56. So, on a good old Nova here, we swapped over this. So, I understand we wasted a bunch of time on it, but yeah, it took exactly 28 minutes to get from level 52 to 56, and then I went to bed because... I was tired. So we're going to get a few minutes of this here. We've got three minutes left of it. I thought it expired while you were offline, but I guess it didn't. So there are three minutes left of it. So we need to complete this awakening quest for um, Nova. We are here at Mains. And uh, I'm going to take advantage of this last three minutes that we have. Because why wouldn't we? And we gotta get 50 kills here anyway. Honestly, just noticed that right now that we had got here. Um, I did invest, I went to Bashim's base, and I actually did invest in some skills finally, because we hadn't been investing. But I felt like at Bashim's I might want some skills, and I actually kind of fell in love with this class a little bit. Um, I still would rather play my sword, so it didn't do that job of dethroning sword. I think the class is going to do it, and I, I want to, you know, I want to progress my Sork, so we're not going to go to it yet, but I think Lawn is the class that's going to dethrone it. Every time I watch a Lawn video, it just looks like a lot of fun, and so I just think it's going to end up being, it's going to be the Sork's undoing on my channel. Now, the Sork will always be the main, at least from the standpoint of it will never actually go away. I'm going to continue to play it whether I'm, um, whether I'm, like, ridiculously overpowered or not. Or, that's not, what am I trying to say? Like, ridiculously moved on from playing it. It's still going to, like, stay on the channel. Still come around every once in a while, hang out, be a part of the channel. But I don't feel like I'm getting that much experience from these guys. I know I'm 56 now, so it's slower grind now. But I feel like I'm not getting very much experience for this being 600%. I feel like it's, like, not actually giving me 600%, because this seems really low. Maybe mains just don't give you a lot of um, experience, but it just feels off. Feels off, if I'm being honest. Alright, real quick before we go... There's a giant main here, so let's let's have some fun, try to kill him. And then we'll continue our awakening quest. See if we can keep this going. I do like all of her different like, skills. They're all like unique and they're kinda I don't know, they're unique and they're kinda fun to use. They're not super difficult. She's got good mobility. Not great mobility. At least for me. Like, obviously, things are contingent on me. There are some things that probably are a lot better, but they're all contingent on me not being terrible, and I still am not very good at this, so we're, we're working on it. But I, I do like her stuff, and I guess there's one more, like, really strong guy, so we're going to take him out. Hello, buddy. Get these guys in the... Oh, I gotta... Well, I guess I could have done it. Doesn't, doesn't matter. I really like that skill. That, like, this, like, LBRT that summons those guys. I really like that. Now, you can get it, the, there's, like, two variations of it. I think one's, like, a chain and one's, like, not. But, yeah, there's a couple of variations, and they're all, they're, they're both fairly good. But it's just got a lot of, like, CC for this. It just absolutely... If you're strong enough to, to do quick damage to things... I almost found at Bashim's it was quicker to, like, almost leave. What is happening to my character? Dude, I can't hit this guy. I can't hit him. What is happening? Why is he so... Why did he take no damage? Okay. But I'm going to go ahead and progress here. But I did find at Bashim's it was, like... Some of the mobs you could just leave, and it was quicker to just go, and as many as you could hit at once to knock them out in a couple of hits, that was better than... Because on Sork, it's quicker to, like, revolve through. You can single target quicker and kind of revolve through them. With this, it's more AoE, 
CC, and so um, it was a lot quicker to not focus down like a small group. It was quicker to run by and kind of gather them up. On Sork, you can kind of do that quick explosion and then move on to the next one. Here, these are a little bit longer um, combos. I mean, they're one button press, but they're kind of a long combo to get them off. And so, yeah, it's it, it's a little bit different of a play style, which I like. Um, but like I said, we're going to see how Awakening plays, because that's what I did this character for, was the Awakening. And so... Hopefully the Awakening is good. If not, we will pack it up, move on to Ranger, because that's the one that's going to happen next if I don't like Nova Awakening. But we'll see. This is getting recorded, by the way, getting recorded way in advance. Obviously, this is getting recorded on the Friday that PSO2 launches. Well, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and potentially Monday is only PSO2 New Genesis beta, so keep that in mind. This is getting recorded a long time in advance. But yes, Let's continue with this. I don't know what's next. Next might be just completing it. I don't remember how long these Awakening quests are. No, they're all a little unique, so we'll see what the next part is. All right, so we are here at the next area. I mean, there was a thing with the skeletons, but it was only 20 kills. That was real quick and easy. So we are here at Elric Shrine, and I just totally whiffed that, but it's okay. I think I'm a little underpowered for this. I don't know. Not maybe not for Alex Shrine, but I feel like I feel like 197 258, I know I'm getting hit right now, is probably questionable for a level 56. Obviously I have way better gear on my sword, but is this really the mob hold on, we're gonna go up here. This can't be the mob density of Elric Shrine. Oh no, this is this... Oh, I love El... I forgot about Elric Shrine. I completely forgot about Elric. I used to love Elric Shrine. But, um... What was I gonna say? I I don't think my gear is bad for a level 56. I just think it should probably be better. But this was never, you know... The gear on this character was never meant to be, like, world beater levels of good. It was just supposed to be good enough to get us through the story. And then I decided that I wanted to... I wanted to use that 600% EXP pot and see... It wasn't even a potion, it was a, it was a scroll or a, Yeah. So I used that and... And it was worth it. I think it was. I mean, going from 52 to 56 in the limited amount of time that I did it in... I mean, doing it in minutes, like 28 minutes, is ridiculous in my opinion. I still gotta get her movement down. It, sometimes I want to use that dash, and it puts you into like this blocking mode, and I just then your character's moving at like the speed. Like, look at how slow she's walking, like because she's in like the shielding mode. So I need to get out of doing that. But really, honestly. None of this is relevant because I'm going to be using the uh, Awaken stuff anyway. Even, no matter how much I like this, the Awakening had to be good. And so we'll find out. Ah, oh, yes, Elric. We have to come back here with her and do like a, I don't know, like an hour Elric. I mean, I want to do hour-long farm sessions doesn't necessarily have to be on Sork. We can do it on any character. We're just going to do an hour at and then whatever location I'm at. And the positive thing is is that if I choose to continue this or I do um what am I trying to say? Or if I do Ranger or Lon or whoever I end up doing I will be able to have hour longs at some of these older places that I like. Like, there's no... I'm not coming to Elric Shrine to farm Sork. Like, that's stupid. My Sork has 244 AP. Like, I'm not coming to Elric Shrine to farm for her. But, I will come to Elric Shrine to farm for... Um... With this. With, like, the Nova. So, that's the one positive that it... Is my... Hold on... Is it really up here? The end of the quest. But yes, I can come here with the Sork or whoever we end up doing. I can do it on, on this character. 
for some of these older areas that I really enjoy. I really love Bashim's. I really love Elric Shrine. Um, there's some other ones. What's it? What's another? What's another like medium level? I mean, abandoned iron mines. If I could, I couldn't find the spot. What is this? Memories and the ancient stone chamber. Is that it? Are we done? No, more Nova Awakening. Okay, let's come over here. Let me continue to talk. So, is that a dead Nova? Death's door. Everyone here lies dead, and they all look alike. My, look alike myself. You know, we we really translated that at quality skills. They are the Onellas. A Francesca Sarich, perhaps even killed by her. Okay. But my point is, is that we can do some of those. I'm trying to think of some other areas that I really liked. Um, oh, I know which one. I don't know what it's called. I'll pop the map open here in just a second. I know exactly what, um, what place I'm talking about. Um, right over here, the Helms Post. I know Helms is, like, pretty common. Someone told me, um, I don't even know where the jail is on the map. I forget where the jail is. I want to go, I know, um, I'm pro I'm way over leveled for Sork, but I do want to try to farm Basilisks at some point. There's a lot of places I never farmed because... This place over here is really fun, the Rude Sulfur Mine. Um, I forget where the jail is. Foggins and Nagas are fun, but I don't know how much... I don't really want to go there again. They're kind of... I hate the desert with a burning passion. I want to try this out over here, the Warrigan Nest. There's a bunch of places that I want to try. Centaurs. Um, I don't remember where the jail is. They want me to do... Pilafay Jail or whatever it is. I don't even remember where that is on the map. There's Star's End. That's the goal. Get to Star's End. I've never... I should go out to Pirates too. I don't know why I'm going over this in this video, but I got on the topic and so I was going over it. Because we know I love a good ramble. But, yes. The point is, is whatever, like, level 56 character, we're going to have to get that character upgraded to 60 and get the gear upgraded so we got to farm money. So at some point, we'll have to go through all of that. Um, so there's another, there's another, whatchamacallit, Nova here doing this with me. Young, Young Quatron. Quat, Quat, Quatur, Quaturin? Quaturin? Okay, give them that. This is pretty cool. This is really cool. This is like... This is a really cool awakening quest. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, I guess we're fighting. Yeah, lady, I'm just gonna eat your damage, and I'm gonna deal more damage than you can deal to me. Actually, I don't think this is gonna work. This isn't gonna work. I don't deal enough damage. I don't deal enough damage. I don't really know how to... You just gotta block? You gotta, like, get in your block stance here and... I mean, I take those hits pretty well, so, I'm, you know... Wow, she is tanky. This is, like, ridiculous. I mean, this is, like, next level of tank. We just use the same skill. This is, this is like, extreme levels of tank out of her. I, did I just whip? No, I got a crit on that. This is next level. She has, like... I really like this, though. She's got, like... I, I like this. This is a lot better than I... Like, Sorks. He's kind of got the thing on a hill. This is cool. They, like, designed this area for this. This is nice. But she has so much health. Is this just, like further proof that like this is a tank class not a high dps class that we're just smacking each other here and why is it jumping didn't hit a dude this is this is ridiculous just, just 
smack her a bunch. Just smack her with the right bumper a bunch. Okay, this does absolutely no damage. Gotta actually use skills. Uh, this is... This is something here. She does quite the... That doesn't hit her. She's too far away. What does she do? Oh, is she... Wait. I stun her? And that's not what I wanted to do. And I... Oh, okay, dude. Oh, she... Okay. Easy! Slight work! Only it still says defeat her, so... You know, I don't believe she's actually dead. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay. 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 Guess we did beat her. Can I... Put me in standby, then. Okay. Yes, we did, in fact, kill Francesca Sarich. And what item did I just get? Queen of Thorns. Oh, look over there. After she died, the tree, it's glowing red. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Wield the thorn of the young Quater Quuterin? Quuterin? Alright, so this is the awakening weapon. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me gimme give gimme give gimme give gimme give gimme. Give me the awakening weapon. I'm kinda excited for this. Cause I think I'm gonna really like it. Okay, so we have Francesca Sarich's journal. Ah, good old combos. So, back RB, Bitter Rain, into Y, Rising Star. Okay. So, hold on, I gotta... How do you... Is it equipped? No. Oh. Cannon Sting. Okay. So, it was... What the? Why is it just... Wait. What is it doing? Wait. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I think it wants me to do this. That's really weird. Um, hold on. Switch back. I want to try that again. That's weird. I... Hold on. Cool down. And then let me do it again. That's a weird light combo. I don't really like that, but... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This has... This... Ha... So if I... Okay, hold on. Cool down. I want to try this again. Cool down. That's interesting. So... Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know if I like that. I, I guess I have to unlock combos, but... Ooh, 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 I like that. Nick Nick likes that. That's interesting. I, I like... Take it... Hello? How'd I do that? What the... You have to... What? How can't I do it again? I can't... Oh, it's because I don't have any... I don't have any skill points. Hold on. Let me go kill one of these things. Come here, buddy. I need to slap you around with right bumper so I can get this back. This thing has no damage. I gotta buy a better one. Um. Yeah, I'll... Uh, okay. I don't know about that. I, I, I guess I gotta unlock more skills, because it's not letting me do, like, anything. Okay. Practice. So, LTB, Blooming Icy Thorns, to Rising Star, to Royal Fencing. So, LTB... Okay, let me try this. LTB, Y... Okay, hold on. Let me cool those down, try that again. So, it's LTB, Y, and then back RB. Okay, let's try that again. LTB, Y, and I messed that up because I went forward, not back. I mean, I do like this. That's nice looking. You have the forward, and then the back one moves you forward, which is nice. I think I prefer that more. Okay, let me try this one more time. So that, 
into Y, into... Okay, yeah, I'm out of skill points. Okay, whatever, let's go. Let's, let's, or out of mana or whatever. Okay, uh, King of the Dead. Axion, King of the Dead. Um, tells the tale Axion, the King of the Dead. It's like, a, this is an actual quest, okay. Or, okay, maybe it wasn't. That might be. Is that it? Can I go? I want to go practice this. Um, she acquired the altar to summon Axion, and she still can't. Tr okay. Is there? Okay, so now, now we're on Nova Succession. I don't think I want to play Succession. I want to play Awakening if I'm gonna play Nova. This thing just does no damage, so I, I don't think I can really... I can't get a good judge of it because it doesn't do any damage. Okay, let me try something. Okay, so like... I don't have any skills with it. That's the issue. Is that all my best skills are... Okay. Actually, that's not bad damage. That's not bad damage for like... Only being able to... I feel like her... Uh, I might not like this because I think her awakening is going to have a lot to do with switching back and forth. And I don't really like the maze. It's just not my thing. Well, let's go take a look at the skills. Let's come back down here and take a look at what skills we have. I don't... I, I like the sword, but it's... I think it's a lot of switching and I don't really want to do a lot of switching. Um, So we have On Guard... Which is super armor for 10 seconds. Okay. Select awakening. I thought I have awake. I am in awake. What are you talking about? Oh, I have to. Ch okay. Uh, yes, I want to I wanna do awakening. I don't want to do succession. I have awakening selected. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Hello? Okay, whatever. Combust life. That's... Ooh! HP recovery. Okay, I like that. Okay, why are you being weird? Okay, there we go. Extend. Comet. So forward B. Scythe throw. Okay, we have to unlock some of the stuff because I... What is Star Ring? Hello? That lo Oh, I gotta get the 58. Hello, that looks cool. These are these are passives. Okay, so those are passives that I can't unlock yet. Um, well, this is cool. That's cool. Give me what starfall? Oh, give me that. Give me, give me that. Um, comet. Interesting. Okay. Let me see here. Oh, you can... Okay, you can, like, hold that. Can I... So if you... Hold on, let me see. So if you throw this, can you, like... Okay, can you interrupt it? That's my question. Oh, okay. I was gonna use that skill, but it's on cooldown. Okay, so let's kill this guy slowly. And then, okay. Let's go up here. No. Not. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay. That's okay. Okay, we're getting in the... Let me kite him up again. Kite up. I want to see how this works. I need them to get kind of... Eh, we'll try it anyway. Okay, that has some good... Okay, that has some good AoE. Okay, I can get behind that. This has a pretty quick cooldown. The Comet. Okay. I can get behind this. I, I don't want to... I know... See, it's always tough because I know that the optimal way to play this is to switch back and forth. But I don't want to. I just want to use the weapon that I like. So, I have to judge, like, it's like when I was using Sork, 
I wish the succession was this. I understand that's not how this works, but that's what I wish. But let's see here. Let me go down here. This skill is ridiculous. That skill right there. That is insane. That is absolutely ridiculous. Okay. I think this thing has bought itself at least a little bit of play. I don't know, like, I don't know how much play. Because I think I'm going to still start and attempt to work on one. But I think this thing is... What, what is happening? I just got... I just got bullied by that guy. But, like, some of these... Like, this skill. That skill is just so much fun and so good. And I I just think... I think we're gonna... I think it's good enough. Like, that's, that's a nice skill. And I do like how the left trigger... It's a one-second cooldown, but this helps you move pack-to-pack -pack without having to have Comet. So I think... I'm, I think it's good enough. I do. I think it's good enough. That's so fun. I love that skill. And I can always switch over, but I don't know. There's probably... So I'm trying to figure out which skills. So if I use... So that doesn't... Not enough stars breath. So this doesn't switch. That switches. That doesn't... That's not what I want. Okay, so that doesn't... Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Switch back. Okay, that's this. Um... So I really only need to have this skill powered up. The LTB. Because it switches. So it needs to be... I don't know. I, I really like this. I think we're going to start... I, might, I probably won't do... I know it only took us five episodes, so it's really well not that long to get to Awakening with Nova, but I feel like... I feel like that's, like, ridiculously what I've, I, I... This is what I thought it would be, and I like it a lot. So I don't feel like I can just, like, be like, eh, not gonna do this. I feel like... I feel like it's, it's, it's a thing, and we're gonna... We're gonna use it. So, I guess... I don't know what the next episode of this is. I mean, we could do the succession quest, but I don't really want to do succession on this. Because this is, like, fast-paced. I like this. It's fast-paced. You comet into the next one. The comet's cooldown is really quick. You can move... Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do this. You can move pretty quickly across the, like across a battlefield with this thing. Like, it's quick. And Comet's cooldown is slow enough that I think... I probably would. <sighs> it's tough. Hold on. Let it cool down. I gotta see. So if you switch out into this, what's the quickest way... Okay, there's no enemies. But if I assume... Okay, so if I assume I switched into it by doing this... I guess I can just switch straight out with a point like that, but let's see. So if I'm in here and I would like do this, yeah, you can switch out of it right out of a combo. Does it let you switch out of it out of every combo? So if I do this, I wouldn't do it out of that. So I could get rid of the LTX. Um, okay, hold on. Switch back. Switch back. Okay, so if I do this... Oh, okay. Okay, so I would keep LTB and LTR... R, or LTLB. That's the... Or, oh my gosh. Losing my mind. That's this skill. So you'd have that. And then before those things even get done running, you can switch back into it. So that'd be my rotation probably. So out of this, we would go into this, and then I would LTRB, and then into the Y. I know it didn't do the LTRB the way I wanted it to do it there, but okay. Okay, that that makes sense. Okay. So yeah, I definitely got to give this a go. I might do some work with... Um, I don't know why I'm just RB spamming this guy, but... Um, I probably will get to work on Ranger and whatnot, but... Um, 
we got. I gotta give this at least a little bit of a try. I'm not gonna give up on it like right now. Because this is too much fun. I really, I really like this class, and it's got a rotation that I think I can use, and not. It's got a fairly like make sense rotation from one mob to the to the next. It's not like ridiculous, and so I think I can get. I can I could farm on this I think for a while. The sork the problem with the sork as much as I love my sork is it's so like muscle memory intensive on that cuz you got to you got to go this and you got to do that and then I have to hit this and I have to hit this button. And with this this is just easier. This is just easier. I like it. I think I like it too much. Too much to be honest. I need to get better gear and we need to see how bad it wrecks stuff with a little bit better gear. I think I have like 1 billion in storage right now. So I have enough to upgrade it. Obviously we still need to upgrade Sork. But yeah. I need... Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna give this a good try. A good go. A good go of it. Because yeah, I just... The comment, this quick... It's just got quick movement. And I love it. And I'm sure there's a couple more skills that I can unlock that are kind of different button presses that I'm sure I will like just as much. But yeah, you do that, and then you do this into that, and then you're back to this. I think, yeah, 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 yeah. We made the executive decision. Nova's sticking around in the rotation for now. It might disappear out of the rotation eventually. Or maybe... Who knows, maybe Sork will disappear out of the rotation. I don't know. I just can't see myself giving up my Sork. I just love... I love Yennefer too much to give that Sork up. Not because it's Yennefer, just that's the character name. So I just I just don't see myself giving it up. But that's going to do it, guys. We are Nova Awakened now. And... I probably don't play it optimally, to be honest. That's probably not the optimal way to play Nova, but I gotta enjoy grinding, so I have to be able to play it in weird ways that I enjoy, so that's fun. I don't know when the next episode of Nova will be up. Probably soon, because I probably won't grind. I'll probably grind a little tonight, maybe. Won't be recorded, but I'll grind a little bit, make sure that this isn't just like a honeymoon phase of playing this character, and uh, we'll see. But it took like 16 hours to get to 56, so... I'm not too concerned with investing time into Ranger or Lawn just to see how they do. I think you want to do a Lawn succession. See, I wanted to play Ranger for the succession, or for the Awakening, but the succession Ranger actually looks pretty fun too. So I don't know what way I would go with that, but yeah. I can't get too invested on different characters because... Of the way I like to level them up, I just like to throw a high level gear on there and storm through the story. On this, we just got done with Kalfi and we're on to Medea or whatever. Or the, yeah, we're, we're done with Kalfi and whatever the next one is after that uh, is where we are. Because as, as soon as I came over here to this area, I immediately went to, um, I went to Bashim's and I finished that up. Once we came over here towards Altanova, I think... It wants us to go to, like, the magma weirdo quarry area, this mar, the Omar Lava Cave. I just went straight over to Bashim's over here and grinded to 56. So, I don't know. I don't know if I'd keep doing that. I'd do the story because it's the story and you should probably do it, but I don't know. It's just such a drag. It takes forever. And there's not a whole lot of action for me to record. So... I don't know. But I think I've babbled on for long enough, guys. This video is going to be really long because we messed around with Nova Awakening for a while. So it's a winner in my book. I really like it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. <laughs> Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. Um, this was recorded a few days before you guys are going to see it. So maybe I'll have made a decision to abandon Nova by then. But I really enjoy it when this video was recorded. And uh, I will work on getting... Working on getting better quality videos out, like, I think I can make some really cool hour-long videos that you, not hour-long watching, but like an hour-long grind video, and I think, um, I think I can make some cool stuff out of that, um, like a series out of that, so we'll see. I'll stop babbling on. I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you have not, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Peace.